I met Waka Flocka and that was really cool, so. Hey guys, what's up? It's Alicia from Alicia Meat Sticks, and I know, long time no see. So today I'm going to be talking about songs that I am currently super obsessed with. Like, I'm listening to these songs on Spotify, like, on repeat, like, 50 times a day. So yeah. The first song I have for you guys is called Lake Up by Boston Manor. I'm making a video about Boston Manor soon, um, because I fucking love them, and you guys need to go check them out, because I feel like they're not getting enough attention that they deserve, so... Anyways, Leica is a song that they just, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right by the way, but I hope so. Anyways, Leica is a song by Boston Manor. They just released it because their new album is coming, or their debut album actually is coming out, and that was just like a teaser song. It is so fucking good. Like, I'm so stoked for this album. It definitely reminds me of their very first EP more so than like what they've done recently. And I'm so excited for it. It is such a great song. Um, it kind of wells in between like it kind of gets like a little slow and a little heavy at times like it's a very it's a very good combo and it's just so fucking catchy after listening to that song please go check out their other songs if you haven't already because they are bae so the next song i have for you guys is called drive by with confidence and i'm sure many of you guys know about with confidence i meant to put them in my music recommendations like a year ago but i didn't because i was like oh they're not making any new music and look where they are now so um, anyways, yeah, Drive is such a good song. It's a very, like, upbeat and catchy song, and if you like upbeat and catchy songs, well, this is the song for you. And it is very pop punk as well. Next song I have for you guys is called Coming Down by Halsey, and I love Halsey. I don't think I really talk about her much, but I've loved her since Ghost came out. Coming Down is off of her Badlands album. It was her debut album, I believe. It is so gorgeous like her voice in it is just so it's like so fluttery and like i don't know i feel like i'm in the clouds when i listen to it it's just like so awesome next song i have for you guys is called takes my body higher by shafi featuring lincoln jesse i believe is his name i found out this song through actually one of my friends and normally i don't like this kind of music but i think that the the guy's voice in this song is so beautiful and it's really it just makes me feel very fluttery on the inside and like lovey-dovey. I think it's a really like nice fun like song to listen to like at night and just like when you're chilling and shit. Um, it's more like, you know, I would say EDM but like, I, I don't know what that music even is but it's, I, I normally don't like that stuff but because this guy's voice is so good, I like this song. So next song I have for you guys is Seasons by Major League. I have loved this song for a long time but I kind of like rediscovered it. Um, and I just can't stop listening to it now and it makes me really sad because like they're no longer a band and stuff and I really like Major League um, and Seasons is just such a beautiful song I think and I want to blast it in my house all the time so go check it out it's very Major League if you don't know them they're like a pop punk band not anymore obviously they broke up so last final song on my list that I am currently obsessed with is a song that actually like I've known for a long time it's just like one of those songs you just like rediscover after like not listening for a while and that is The Story So Far by Newfound Glory and I'm pretty sure this was the song that The Story So Far got their name from but it made me remember how much I fucking love Newfound Glory like I love this song so much it is so beautiful and a very real like the message is very relatable to me and it is just flawless so so again i'm really sorry that like it took so long for me to get a video up i was just really sick it was i was so sad like it was just awful so and i went to work tour while being sick and it was not fun i literally had to push through it um i mean i had fun at warp tour but like when i got home i was fucking wrecked like i was just like shit like i literally felt like i got hit by a bus especially because as, um, so Sum 41 was the last set, and as I was leaving with my friend, someone fucking crowd surfed, like, when the set was already over, and they flew right into my head, <laughs> and he kicked me in the head, and, um, I definitely got, like, a low-key concussion from that, um, because I was driving, and I, I don't know if any of you guys are from San Diego, but, like, the, the concert was at Qualcomm Stadium, which is, like, the Chargers football stadium, 
and getting out of there is sometimes really confusing because there's like two different highway entrances and I always forget which one it is and like I literally did not know where I was. I was so fucked up in the head from getting kicked and just being sick and everything like it sucked. So the concert Warped Tour itself was really fun. I met Waka Flocka and that was really cool. So anyways, um, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for sticking with me even though I was like inactive for like a couple of weeks or so. So give it a like if you like any of these songs on my list and let me know what songs you are currently obsessed with because I would love to know that. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already because that'd be really cool of you. And I'll see you guys next week.